वेलकम टू डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ इलेक्ट्रॉनिक्स एंड टेलीकम्युनिकेशन एट विद्या लंकर इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ टेक्नोलॉजी इन दिस डिपार्टमेंट वी हैव टेकन दिस न्यू इनिशिएटिव टू स्टार्ट आवर ओन यूट्यूब चैनल इन दिस यूट्यूब चैनल वी आर गोइंग टू अपलोड ऑल अवर एक्सपेरिमेंट्स वीडियो वैल्यू एडेड कोर्स वीडियो और एनी अदर इम्पॉर्टेंट वीडियोज दिस मटीरियल विल बी अवेलेबल टू ऑल द स्टूडेंट्स इन मुंबई यूनिवर्सिटी एंड दिस मटीरियल विल हेल्प स्टूडेंट्स Uh, to enhance their learning not just in their classroom but even outside the classroom i hope that everyone will uh, like this our effort and in case of any query comments anything they can put it in the comment box thank you hello everyone welcome to software simulation laboratory this is experiment number 3 Title: Plot of Step, Impulse, and Ramp Response for Second Order System with Unity Feedback in MATLAB. Now let's look into some theory of it. The order of a system is defined as the highest power of s in the denominator of the transfer function. A first order system only has s to the power one in the denominator, and a second order system has s to the power two in the denominator. Now let's uh, look into the program. Let's go to new script. Editor window will open. Now we'll start typing the program. So now we are done with the typing of the program. Let's see step by step uh, the program. CLC is used for clearing the uh, output uh, window data, and uh, clear all is used to close all the objects in workspace. Then we define uh, s. Uh, we define transfer function of s by this command, and then omega n, which is the natural frequency, is user input and zeta equal to 0.2 is defined uh, zeta is the damping coefficient or damping ratio which should be in between 1 and 0 now we define the uh, formula for transfer function of second order system that is y equal to transfer function omega n into omega n and this means that uh, transfer function this comma this means that uh, omega n into omega n is the numerator and the this part is the denominator now we start plotting the step response first we divide the given figure into um, rows and columns by using subplot and we access the first subplot for the step response of this system there is a function to plot step response directly that is step y and we give title for that step response now we need to find the ramp response ramp response is basically found by dividing the step response by s and this is displayed in the second uh, option we have and the title is given for this also and for finding the impulse response also we have a direct function which is impulse y and the, uh, thus we uh, have defined all the three step response ramp response and impulse response for this second order equation now let's check the output let's enter the natural frequency say 3 we get the equation that is y equal to the one which we defined using transfer function okay now we got the output this is the step response this is the ramp response and this is the impulse response that we got thanks for watching